All right, welcome back. So today, we move on in the favorite players with the San Jose Sharks. And this one's also been a long time coming. And apologies for that. So the San Jose Sharks, why do I like them, you ask? Their logo, I pretty much fell in love with. Ever since I saw the logo, I was like, oh yeah, I gotta like this team. And until this year, they were my third favorite team. But then they started getting bad. And when a team gets bad, they tend to move down in my list. Except if you're the Flyers or the Coyotes. So Tampa, who was at the number four spot, moved up to number three. So now Tampa is in the top three. I gotta organize these in my favorite team um, order, so I have to do that. And that, but they're still a solid team. I right, 20, 2017, 18, and 2018, 19 were years where I was thinking this this team could go all the way. Then they lost Joe Pavelski, and then I think everything went downhill from there. And there were there was already doubts. There was already doubts that this team was not going to be good in the next couple of years. So I it didn't really surprise me. I was ready for a for a few few more years of bad. So here we go. Number ten, we have Tomas Hurdle. Tomas Hurdle, I think, is still with the team, but he just has an amazing name, and I love watching him play. Number nine, Kevin LeBanc. Kevin LeBanc, I think, it was, I think, is with the Avalanche now, and he got signed that deal. Number eight is a player that might actually surprise people. He's going to move up in my list. He's going to move up in my list, no doubt no doubt in my mind, because he's starting to become a solidified starting goaltender for San Jose. Aaron Dell. And Aaron, and Aaron Dell is, he played much better this season than he has any other season, I think. Even though this team over there was bad, he still played really good. Number seven, Mikhail Bodker. Um, you guys might be wondering why the heck is Mikhail Bodker at number seven? He was traded to San Jose, traded to Ottawa. He was just like his name really interested me, and now he's going to Europe. So, guess I'm not gonna be able to see him. Number six, this one might surprise a little bit of people. It's Patrick Marleau. Now, Patrick Marleau, I felt like a little bit of a different presence in Patrick Marleau than I did when he was in Toronto. He, I don't know if it was that he looked better in a San Jose jersey. Or that he played his played pretty much his entire career in San Jose, but now he's with Pittsburgh, and he's just he's one of my favorite players of all time, and he's been playing for a long time, and I honor that. Number five is Yunez Donskoy, and that might surprise people that Yunez Donskoy is at number five, but he but he is. Number four is Brent Burns. Brent Burns because of the beard. I saw something last night where like the evolution of the evolution of Brent Burns, and it was just all the pictures of him every year in his career. And you could see it all just like slowly coming to where he is now. The beard's amazing, and he's a pretty solid defenseman. So, well, not as good this year, but it's all. Number three, he's probably going to go up in the list, not down. Uh, I mean, number three is probably going to be like where Aaron Dell is in the next couple of years. Martin Jones. Martin Jones is personally one of my favorite goaltenders in this league. But now that he's starting to become bad, I'm starting to wonder, eh. But, like, he's been with me since the beginning of my fandom of hockey, so I kind of have to stick with him. So, yeah. Number two is Joe Pavelski. Now, Joe Pavelski, of course, is with Dallas, and I support him with Dallas. He's going to definitely be in the fear of Dallas players. And he he was, like, the face of the franchise before he went to Dallas. And I'm surprised San Jose didn't try to sign him at all. I don't know if they didn't have cap space, but I'm surprised they didn't. And finally, number one. We got a rookie card of him in our last Hockey Card Collection opening. It is Logan Couture. And Logan Couture has one of those names. One of those names that like really makes me... That like is one of my favorites. And he also is a very solid player. And I can't wait to see him grow in San Jose. And I can't wait to see this team do better in the future. So that's going to be it for this little warm-up video, I guess. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed it, do make sure to hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, we're at 157, trying to get to 200 by the end of the year. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.